with the prescription of IPOB as a terrorist organization, yeah. do you think that the Biafra agitation is dead and buried? To a greater extent, it is dead and buried. The way Biafran agitators have been going about it, they were painting the, the country and our economy in a very bad light. Yeah, it cannot be dead and buried. They are not terrorizing anybody, you understand? They are just fighting for their freedom. No, it's not dead and buried. Why? You cannot just label someone name and expect the person to stop. That's when the agitation even starts to rise again. I cannot say the agitation is dead, but the way the IPOP is going about it is not really the right way. No, 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 it's not that. Can't die. Lie, lie, till this one end. Why? Because they are wounded already. When you wound somebody, to hit that place, it's not easy. I don't think it's um, dead and buried. For them to say it has been prescribed, I think they are just putting on more fire on it. Yeah, is that what they say that is dead and buried that most of our leaders are saying? But I don't believe so. It's not compulsory that we should be together. Even if Yoruba said they want to go, they should allow us to go. But we should go peacefully. Uh, basically, it's, there's no way it can be buried. It's just like a wound or an injury that it's in there. If you don't treat it properly, the pain will always come up.